Hi everyone, how's it going? I hope you're great. I'm actually so glad to God for being able to talk to you all. Firstly, let me go and define myself a little bit for you. My name is Bream. I'm from I'm Kurdish Syrian living in Lebanon and I'm 19 years old. Without further ado, let us just go and jump into it to be telling you, sharing with you about this little testimony. I was born and raised as a Muslim. I came from an Islamic background. Uh, and let's say my story starts with a Friday's night. When mom encouraged me and my brother Haytham to make it to a church, there was a meeting at that church. We went for the first time in our lives to a church. And what we found, we were shocked actually with how with the way they were treating and welcoming us. We were experiencing something new. We didn't get anywhere else. Day after day, as it continued going, without having a major goal, until that day when something happened. I came back from, from a Sunday's meeting and I started, started to cry out to God saying please if you're if you are real if you are the true god so please heal me from addiction addiction yes my first exposure to pornography was in the age was in the age between 10 and 11 years old and then i found myself being addicted For the last six up to seven years, I wasn't able to leave it. The plans I made, the searches I had, the tips and tricks I practiced, and the list goes on and on. And uh, nothing of these set me free. And even some days, I was crying to God during the Islamic prayer, saying, I can't stand it anymore. Heal me. And to be honest with you, I wasn't getting any better. While I was praying on that day, in the name of Jesus, it was my first time praying with confidence, praying with belief. This is the longest amount of time from years being far from pornography. Until this very day, I can say it out loudly that for the last four months, Jesus set me free. The Lord changed my perspective. Jesus, Jesus renewed my mind, changed, changed my heart, and even literally changed my whole life. Thank you for listening, and I hope this and I, I hope this could reach everybody on this earth. And I pray that this message to go and make a difference, maybe, or to let you rethink, or even to give yourself another chance. That in fact, you will see one day. Thank yourself for taking that chance later on future. And. Thank you, Lord Jesus, and also thank you, Horizon, for offering that opportunity for being able to talk and share about my story through you. And for those who are listening, who knows, if we didn't get a chance to meet here on earth, it's okay. I'm 100% sure that we will later in heaven with our heavenly father see you there in jesus name peace bye